Welcome back to our channel. It's been a long time, but we are back with a brand new video. The Bunny Room Tour. In this video, I am finally going to show you guys Oreo's room, and I'm going to link everything down below if you guys are interested. Before we get started, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button for unlimited bunny content. Alright, let's go. Let's start with the flooring. I get a lot of questions about this particular type of rug. This is 9x12 Senegal jute rug that I had customized to fit this room. If you guys want the website for this one, just comment down below. Um, so far, Aurea has not tried to chew on it as opposed to his other seagrass area rug that he had destroyed. This is a Tespo Clear Pet Playpen that I got from Amazon. I decided to keep this just to outline the whole room and to protect those baseboards. They're very light and easy to manage. So since this room didn't come with a closet, I had to improvise. I used a clear play pan to save this little corner for Oreo's necessities. Here he has an extra pellet bag, his pee pads, his bin with all his blankets and towels, a container for all my cleaning supplies. Here I have his rabbit pellets from Oxo and just a cereal container for easy access. Oh, hi baby! Here he has his eco-friendly litter pellets from Oxo, his bedding from Carefresh, and of course, I get a nine pound hay from Oxwell from Chewy and I keep it in a little tight container down there. Over here is his first litter box corner. This is a toy from Oxwell that I purchased through Chewy. And this is the open Purina litter box system that Oreo mostly uses. Underneath here is just his litter pellets, his bedding, and a whole ton of hay. Over in this corner, I just have his Ikea doll bed that I purchased from Amazon. Top with the cushion that I had purchased from Bun Loaf by Charlie from the Etsy shop. I love the feel of this material, it's so soft. This is just a dog bed from a store called Five Below. I just thought it was cute, I love the color and the star accents on it. This is a cat scratcher hidey house that I just purchased from our local store called Ross. So far he has not eaten any of this, he just chewed most of it. And beside this he loves laying down on. This is the second litter box corner. It's the same brand as the first one, the Purina. But this is the hooded litter box that can turn into an open one like this. So I just put some bedding in here and more hay so he has a variety on where to go. This is his Nui motion detection camera. It pretty much follows Oreo wherever it goes. Here's just a couple footages during the day and with night vision. This is his wooden raised bed that I had purchased from Happy Bunny Shop. As you can see, Oreo tore up a little bit of this already, but this is where he goes when he knows he's about to get some treats. This is Oreo's dining corner. Here he has his water bowl that filters water throughout the day and just a couple bowls for his veggies and pellets. Last but not least, this is his new Toki Hat Villa. This was just purchased from Toki Hat from their Etsy shop and in here is just a waterproof mat that I had purchased separately from Hop and Flop shop. That's all for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit that like button. See you guys next time and remember, live, love, and binky hop. Bye!